welcome to gcd technologies software testing multiple choice questions and answers by watching this video by focusing on my explanation you can get more awareness on software testing software testing multiple choice questions and answers first one what is v model is it test level no sdlc model yes v model is a sequential model software development life cycle model test type no test design technique no so v model is a software development life cycle model sdlc model next other models waterfall model uh, waterfall model v model these two are sequential models next agile model etc incremental and iterative models agile model okay <clears throat> next what is integration testing is it sdlc model no test type no test design technique no test level yes integration testing is a test level see we have four levels of testing in our software testing four levels of testing unit testing integration testing system testing and acceptance testing uh, user acceptance testing is there user accept testing user acceptance testing is is a subset of the acceptance testing that's it okay uh, what is integration testing it is a test level next what is functional testing is it sdlc model no test type yes it is a test type functional testing non functional testing suppose in non functional testing so many sub areas sub categories performance testing usability testing security testing reliability testing all are test types functional testing is a test type test design technique no test level no next what is decision table testing black box test design technique yes decision table testing is a black box test design technique uh, white box test design technique no gray box test design technique no experience based technique no it is a black box test design technique next what is decision testing decision in programming we have decision uh, if uh, if uh, condition is true then uh, go uh, then execute something otherwise execute another block of code decision decision making is is a part of computer programming what is decision making what is decision making a black box test design technique no white box test design technique yes experience based no white box yes decision making testing is a white box test design techniques what are the other techniques uh, in this white box area uh, condition testing statement testing multi condition testing decision testing path testing etc black box test design techniques earlier uh, decision table testing uh, i said uh, black box test design technique what are the other black box test design techniques other popular uh, black box test design techniques equivalent classes boundary value analysis uh, decision table testing state transition testing and use case testing other techniques also there these five are the popular techniques in black box test design techniques category <clears throat> next 
what is exploratory testing is it black box test design technique no white box test design technique no gray box test design technique no gray box means a uh, combination of black and white uh, experience based test design technique yes exploratory testing error guessing etc are the experience based techniques uh, it is uh, informal testing uh, we conduct exploratory testing uh, using experience based test design techniques that is informal testing when we go for informal testing whenever uh, we don't have documentation sufficient time then we can go for experience based testing informal testing next what is sanity testing uh, is it test level no test type no test design technique no test execution level yes see sanity testing comprehensive testing comprehensive testing means complete testing executing all possible test cases next regression testing all are test execution levels okay uh, according to istkb syllabus international syllabus uh, that regression testing is a test type okay uh, our sanity testing is uh, some some uh, uh, some people may call sanity testing also test type but it is test execution level next uh, dash is not a test document test policy test policy is test document test case test case is test document tin project initiation note uh, yes this project initiation note is not a test document it is project document <coughs> next rtm requirements traceability matrix it is a test document only next nine dash is not a test type database testing database testing is a test type security testing it is also a test type functional testing it is also a test type statement testing it is not a test type see statement testing is a white box test design technique statement testing condition testing decision testing all are white box test design techniques next dash is not a test level system testing system testing is a test level acceptance testing it is also a test level functional testing functional testing is not a test level it is test type but this test type can be performed in all levels of testing unit testing integration testing uh, system testing and acceptance testing but functional testing is not a test level next integration testing integration testing is a test level uh, next 11 dash is not a software test life cycle phase requirements gathering requirements gathering is not a software test life cycle phase it is software development life cycle phase test planning it is stlc software test life cycle phase test closer test life cycle phase test design test life cycle phase uh, what are the test life cycle phases requirements analysis test planning test design test environment setup test execution test closure this requirements gathering is not a software test life cycle phase it is a software development life cycle phase next dash is not a software development life cycle phase requirements gathering requirements gathering is a software development life cycle phase only coding coding also is dlc phase test closure test closure is not sdlc phase so answer is 
test closure is not is not a software development life cycle phase next testing testing is sdlc phase requirements gathering test analysis and planning next design next coding ne uh, implementation or coding next testing next release and maintenance so requirements gathering is sdlc phase coding is sdlc phase test closure is not sdlc phase testing is sdlc phase only so answer is test closure is not is not a software development life cycle phase next up which document describes the exit criteria of testing test case no test case doesn't describe uh, the exit criteria of testing test plan yes test plan document describes uh, exit criteria of testing it describes ex uh, entry criteria entry criteria of testing suspension criteria and exit criteria next test summary report no defect report no answer is test plan test plan document describes the exit criteria of testing next 14 <clears throat> dash are the testers of system testing developers say we have four levels of testing testers may vary from one level to another for example unit testing developers conduct unit testing next uh, business analysts business analysts are not testers independent testers yes independent testers like you people conduct testing in system testing level next customers are end users customers are end users of the testers of acceptance testing answer is independent testers are the testers of system testing level next 15th one what are the uh, dash are the means who are the dash are the testers of unit testing developers yes developers conduct unit testing business analysts no independent testers no customers no next the order in which test levels are performed is unit testing integration testing okay acceptance testing no uh, acceptance testing end end level so this is not correct <coughs> second one unit testing system testing no it is not correct after unit integration next third one uh unit testing next integration testing next system testing next acceptance testing yes this is the correct order of test levels first unit testing second integration testing third system testing last one the acceptance testing i i have already told user acceptance don't confuse user acceptance testing uat is a subset of the acceptance testing okay next it depends on the nature of the project no no next what is fault masking creating a test case that does not reveal a fault no error condition hiding another error condition yes yes masking a fault by developer no masking a fault by by a tester no see fault masking means error condition hiding another error condition sometimes some error conditions hide another error conditions that is fault masking next 18th one which is not a part of specification testing specification testing which is not a part of specification testing or you can say black box testing mm, equivalent partitioning it is part of specification testing decision tables part of specification testing decision testing it is not part of specification testing it is part of structural testing use case testing it is part of specification testing answer is which is not a part of specification testing decision testing 
decision testing is a part of structural testing next 19th one Wha uh, white box techniques are also called as structural testing white box techniques are also called as structural testing yes design based no error guessing technique no experience based technique no next last one in this uh, video what uh, what can static analysis not find not find static analysis static analysis part of static testing uh, the use of the use of a variable before it has been defined no unreachable code or dead code no memory leaks yes see static